Hello everyone. Here we are having an exponential equation to solve. So let us see that how do we solve this. To solve this equation, first we express 49 on the left hand side as 7 square and the equivalent equation becomes 7 square raised to the power x minus 8 into 7 raised to the power x plus 7 is equal to 0. The indices on the left hand side first term get multiplied and the equation becomes 7 raised to the power 2x minus 8 into 7 raised to the power x plus 7 is equal to 0. Here it can be observed that the equation is a quadratic equation in 7 raised to the power x. So the solution of this equation from the quadratic formula can be represented as 7 raised to the power x is equal to minus minus 8 plus minus under root minus 8 whole square minus 4 into 1 into 7 all divided by 2 into 1. This can be simplified as 7 raised to the power x is equal to 8 plus minus under root 64 minus 28 divided by 2 which is further simplified as 7 raised to the power x is equal to 8 plus minus root 36 divided by 2. This becomes 7 raised to the power x is equal to 8 plus minus 6 divided by 2 or 7 raised to the power x becomes equal to 4 plus minus 3. This gives us two values for 7 raised to the power x. The first value is 7 raised to the power x is equal to 7 and the second value comes out to be 7 raised to the power x is equal to 1. Now we consider 7 raised to the power x is equal to 7. This can be represented as 7 raised to the power x is equal to 7 raised to the power 1. And since bases are equal on both the sides, the indices also must be equal, which gives us the first value of x as equal to 1. Considering the second value of 7 raised to the power x, this is represented as 7 raised to the power x is equal to 7 raised to the power 0. Here again, since bases are equal, the indices also must be equal and the second value of x comes as equal to 0. It can be verified from the original equation that both these values of x satisfy the given equation and hence both x is equal to 1 as well as x is equal to 0 are the solutions of the given equation. Thanks for watching.